Hey everyone, Shadow Rockets here, and today, instead of Halo Pro Tips, I have Call of Duty Black Ops 3 Pro Tips. Now, it's not necessarily my tip, but it was from BG Ambition, and you can check out his channel, you saw I linked it yesterday, but, or two days ago I should say, oh man, maybe it was, maybe it was a few days ago, wow, we played a long time ago, BG. So, anyway, go ahead, check out that channel out, it's pretty cool, I hope he uploads a lot more coming up, but this tip today is going to be to remove your silencers and that is going to stand for any single game type except for search and destroy now initially I had my silencer on my gun and to be honest I thought it was a good idea I thought it was a great idea I had it on my Razorback I had it on my Man of War I was just silencer all the way like that was that was my life quick draw grip or just regular grip I probably, no, I think I switched the quick draw grip for the regular grip most of the time. So, it kind of, I don't know, it was, my silencer was my main focus. And, to be honest, I thought it was working, I thought it was great. Initially, it was fine whenever I just started using it for the first time. Playing very conservatively, but it's hard to play conservatively in these game types. Especially hardpoint or domination, when you're trying to actively take over a certain location you're always getting flanked and in this game with such mobility so much speed so much jumping it's it's kind of worthless to have that suppressor on there anyway because you're just gonna be moving you're gonna be moving they're gonna be moving so if you're trying to play the sneaky route and flank them that's fine that'll work a couple times but then you're gonna get start you're gonna start getting flanked sorry about that kinda messed up there and it's just not gonna work out in the long run. You may as well, you sacrifice about one bullet. I think on the Man of War, it bumps it from three to four bullets generally, and on the Razorback, it stayed right around four, but I did manage to go up to five at long distance, so that was really frustrating, and I just, I wouldn't recommend it, because in most of the gunfights, we're pretty evenly matched right here right now. Not a lot of things are open to the beta users or are open to be unlocked and so you want to get every single edge you can and for that purpose only I am going to be using all sorts of things to increase my damage and of course stability so for the Razorback I have all sorts of you know I have the grip I think I have the stock yeah it, I think it's called stock in this one yeah stock and quick draw grip and the reflex sight. So with all of those, it's almost maxed out in stability. And to be honest, it is a very stable gun. I gave up my secondary weapon and a lethal grenade or a tactical. I switched them out randomly. I'm trying to experiment, see which one I don't need more. I might end up dropping the stock um, because it just makes you move faster when aiming and increases stability a little bit. So I don't know. Uh, that's gonna be that's gonna be something that I'm looking towards dropping just to get my grenade back. I don't really use a secondary weapon, so it's not really ne necessary for me. Um, as far as the mana war goes, I don't think that I'm going to get the stock. Well, currently I have the stock on it, but I think I'm going to drop that for high caliber because I I just I feel like high caliber is gonna be worthwhile. So, we're going to see. We'll see how that works. Um, anyway, yes. So, silencers, stealth. Just don't do it. <laughs> However, search and destroy, I do have a lot of stealth perks. I have a lot of hunt down that person perks, you know. I like seeing their footsteps. The tracker perk is quite wonderful for that. So, if you do like search and destroy, if that's your game, then don't feel ashamed to use the silencer. I just don't feel that playing conservatively is very necessary for a lot of these games I started seeing a lot of quick scoping just people playing so aggressively and I got in the mood in I'm probably gonna use a game type where I played really 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 aggressively and I liked it I liked it a lot it was a lot of fun so if you learn anything from this don't forget to like favorite comment and subscribe and if you like this commentary don't forget to let me know down in the comments below Shadow Rockets out